Hi, good morning. My name is Melina Malcosa. I am a high school teacher teaching ethnic studies, Latin American studies, and world history at Roy Ball Learning Center. When I think of humanization, I definitely think of my first two units, which are about identity, about who they are, where they're going, and where are they from. My journey starts pretty early on when I was in high school, and uh, the only thing I was able to study was a very Eurocentric perspective of what history was like. And when I got to college and I took my first ethnic studies course, I realized that I had been deprived of an education that did not have any sort of ethnic studies. And so it became my goal that I would become an ethnic studies teacher and hopefully bring that uh, that space and that, that type of classroom that's centered around students' histories into the education system. There's been a lot of support that has gotten gotten me here, such as PDs like ILC where I was able to see other teachers who have been teaching this for a really long time and just getting the support I needed in order to become the teacher that I am today. So I definitely, a lot of my lessons are, are influenced very much by PDs I have attended, uh, such as the one with uh, Jorge Lopez at Roosevelt High School from ILC. And so I definitely get a lot of influence from teachers who have been doing this for a while. One of the misconceptions that people have about ethnic studies is that it's an easy class, but the reality is that you're actually doing a lot and developing a lot of skills that you need for other classes like English. As a humanizing educator, it, it's a constant struggle, but I think that it's definitely worth it at the end of the day when you see and you realize that a lot of the work that you're doing is going to continue beyond your classroom with your students.